the like ball. First of all, I'm really sorry if I look stiff. I've been having neck pains these days and I had to film this today anyway, so forgive me if I look like a robot for the rest of this video. I thought it would be a great time to make a new tutorial for the Miss Japan series. And one of my favorite foods from Japan is most definitely the dumplings, also called gyoza. These days I eat some at least once a week. I do not understand why most restaurants here just sell them as appetizers. Come on, we need a full meal-sized portion. So when I'm craving dumplings, now I can wear some and just scrape them even more. <laughs> so have fun and here we go! For this project you will need pan translucent and brown clay, black, white and pink paint, a round cookie cutter, a rolling pin, soft pastels, paint brushes, an exacto knife, a needle tool and a dotting tool, some eye pins, a necklace chain, translucent liquid sculpey or bacon bond, and some clays. Mix a tiny bit of tan clay with a lot of translucent clay. Roll out a thin sheet of clay. If your clay tends to stick to your rolling pin or your work surface, you can put your rolling pin in the freezer. This will make your clay colder and less sticky. Now put a little ball of your brown clay in the middle of your circle. Then fold your circle in half, pinching the two sides together. Then use your thumbs to make four to five folds. I had to watch many tutorials that showed how to fold real dumplings and practice a lot before succeeding. So keep practicing and you'll get it. I put some links to those tutorials in the description box below. Now color your dumpling with a bit of yellow pastels and then use your reddish browns and orange pastels to color the top of the folds. This will add a very subtle touch of realism. Carefully insert your eye pins between both layers on each side of your dumpling. Then bake it for 30 minutes. Use your dotting tools to paint on the eyes, mouth and eyelashes. Then add cute pink cheeks. Finally, paint some smaller white dots in the eyes. Now add a layer of glaze. There you go! Now you have your own kawaii dumpling necklace. Thank you guys so much for watching this tutorial. If you have some suggestions for tutorials in the I Miss Japan series, please write them in the comment section below. A huge, huge thank you guys for 3,000 subscribers. And also thank you for sharing and liking my videos and for all your sweet comments. You guys are the best. Have a great day and God bless you. Bye! Oh my gosh, this is Or a bit, uh... Also cold? Uh, also cold? I am my local Asian food store. Grocery. Grocery!